Can you explain sets with real life analogy? Imagine the Avengers, which is team of superhero who lives in Avengers Tower. Whenever an emergency situation arises, Iron Man and Jarvis need to figure out which superhero to send on the mission. To do this, Jarvis needs to be aware of all the super power that team has. But there is a problem. There are many superhero who have the same power, like Thor and Wanda. Both can access to magic. This duplication doesn't make sense for Jarvis's analysis. So he created a program that can only store unique item or unique super power in other. other word if two superhero have a magic as a super power then program will only save magic once jarvis named this amazing program as a set in programming set is a collection that store only unique item it is an unordered collection or a list in which duplicates are not allowed for example if you try to add these three elements magic science and magic to a set then set will automatically figure out that magic is a second element or duplicate element and it will not add it again so in the end set will have only two elements that is magic and science in java set is an interface and we can implement set using classes like hash set and tree set in this video we will implement sets using hash set to use hash set we have to import sets and hash sets class from java.util package after importing we have to create object of a hash set class which will store the string and we will name this object as a super power now our set is ready to use to add elements to set we can use add function so let's add three elements that is magic science and magic to our set so the set will internally figure out that magic is already present isn't in a set and it won't add magic again when you print value of a set then it will have only two elements that is science and magic now if you want to check if the element is present in a set or not you can use contains function if you use superpowers dot contain magic then it will return true because magic element is present in a set if we use superpower dot contain super strength then it will return false because it's not present in a set now if you want to remove something from a set then we can use remove function it is used so if the element is present in a set it will remove it and it will return true but if element is not present then it will return false hash set internally uses hashing technique to search the element so the searching time of a hash set is big of one let me know in the comment section if you want me to create separate video on hashing technique that's it for today's video if you like this video then subscribe to my channel thank you for watching